You must be the one Pericles sent. I am. He said there is an ostracism vote, but didn't tell me what I'm here to do. Of course he didn't. That's what I'm for. If someone is exiled, can they return? If they do, they'll be punished. What does someone have to do to be ostracized? Anyone seen as a threat to the city or the people is enough. And then it is up to the vote. Some have been ostracized for simply being more disliked than the person they're up against. What's my role in this? The votes have already been cast. We don't have long before they're counted. Take the Ostraka in this bag and exchange them with the ones currently under guard. You want me to rig the ostracism? Pericles does. And he has his reasons, I'm sure. Bring me the bag you took from the room and I'll take care of the rest. No one will see me go in or out. Stay here. Goods from all over the Greek world. You wouldn't think this city was besieged by an army of Spartans. It's done. Hmm. You work quickly. What are you going to do with them? Dump them in a well. Ah, it looks like the official has arrived. The votes have been tallied. Overwhelmingly, the people have decided that Anaxagoras should be ostracized from Athens. Slow to fall into friendship, but once you do, continue firm and constant. It will be more difficult for me now that Anaxagoras must leave Athens. We were quite close, although he and Pericles were much closer. It's strange, Pericles wasn't here today to defend him. Would Pericles normally defend someone? A good friend? Of course. Yet, Anaxagoras seems pleased with the result. This day has brought more questions than answers. You said you were close. He was like a mentor to me. Many of my best thoughts came to fruition through our conversations. Who are you? Ask anyone and they'll tell you Socrates. But a name gives you nothing. Our actions determine who we are, and every action has its pleasures and its price. With that said, then, who do you claim to be? I know the price of actions. I have to as a mercenary. That simple piece of information tells me more about you than your name ever could. Explaining oneself must be carefully done. Explaining myself would take more time than I have. Then let us focus on a single recent event. Tell me, as a mercenary, is there anything you wouldn't do? Just because I'm a mercenary doesn't mean I'll do anything. Even if the pay was more than adequate for the task? Even then. What if you were offered something you desperately needed, something you couldn't get anywhere else? Would you move this line you've made for yourself? It moves when I need it to. A strategy for those who must be adaptable, or for those who wish to justify their actions. I decide if my actions are just. You are clearly someone who would do whatever you feel is necessary. Perhaps for Drachmi, or maybe to further a personal goal. That describes a lot of people. I suppose I'm curious why you did it. How could I not be when you're the reason my friend is being forced to leave the only home he's ever known? I 
I did what I was asked to do. And your needs are greater than those of the man you helped ostracize. Still, you raise a fine point. Who is more responsible? Anax and Chorus for getting himself mixed up in this? Or you, for simply sealing his fate? I'm not responsible for his actions. I have one thing to think about, my own. Then I hope you also think about today, about Anaxagoras, about choice. Socrates, there you are. Here I am. You're late. They're all waiting for you. I wish to see Anaxagoras' fate, and so I have. Tell them I'm on my way. Well, it seemed our conversation is at its end. Although I hope it isn't the final one we have. I wouldn't know. Hear it, friend. Anything a mercenary can do for you? Mistrios, hear me, I've seen it. The fall of Athens as we know it. You've seen what? The flower that withers under the loving gaze of the sun. A great sickness is on the horizon. Despair will consume Athens. Sicknesses bringing entire cities to their knees. This only happens in stories. This is no tale of fallen heroes, Mystheus. This is reality, and your fate is intertwined with mine. I need something from you. What do you want? Great warrior, you have arrived at just the right time. To save the city from despair, deliver this single wilted flower to the city physician. Only then will he know of the storm headed our way. You want me to deliver it? Yes, it needs to get there in one piece. All right, I'm in. It's time someone showed me mercy. May the fates be on your side. I should be careful. High security here. This is for you. Thank you, Mistheus. Please, take this. Here, can I help you with anything? Mighty Mistheus, hear me. I am a lowly Athenian and I need your help. You look like the type that can get things done. Easy. There isn't anything I can't do. Really. What do you need? You are too kind, mighty Mistheus. It may sound ridiculous, but it is my dream to become a sophist like the great Thrasymachos or the even greater Protagoras and to leave this lowly life behind. I get it. 
What's the issue? I can't pay for lessons. I am sure I would make a fantastic sophist. And with a mighty mystios such as yourself being in Athens, this could be my chance to get the drachme. So you want me to give you some drachme? I would be in your debt. Here you go. I have something you may be interested in. Share it, friend. I saw you talking to my associate, Pericles. From what I saw, you weren't doing much associating. That's just politics. Pericles is a good man, a fine man, just not the right man. That's not what I heard. From whose lips? His? He was elected. Athens is the seat of democracy. Oh, it is. It's just that the wrong man is sitting in that seat. Did you actually need something? Or did you just want to educate me on the finer points of democracy? Pericles is holding parties for the rich and powerful while we're under siege. What I want is for my people to reclaim control. You could help me. My services don't come cheap. I understand the wills of commerce and the needs of the people. I will pay you handsomely for your services. And how do you want me to help? Help Athens, not me! The Spartans howl outside our city walls. Create chaos among their ranks. Make them suffer as we do. Think about it. Will you take my commission and show the Spartans we are not defeated yet? I have no problem killing Spartans. Good. Kill their commander, Nabis. Destroy their supplies and return to me with proof of your exploits. Show them that we have teeth, too. I'll get it done. Trust me, this is a huge opportunity for you. You've returned. Did you bring the proof I asked for? I think this might interest you. I took it from the commander after I killed him. You know what it's about? What do you mean? Your reaction betrayed you. Yes. The man mentioned in this note was on important business for Athens. Why was the messenger trying to get to Mytilene? She was to help distribute supplies to the people there. ...to help them against their oppressors. Who is this man to you? You look concerned. He was only an aide. It was his mission that was important. I hope this proves I can be trusted to get the job done. Proved you're competent, yes. Trusted? You did read the note. I had to make sure it was proof of what I did. It could have been anything. A good point. And because of this, I have another task for you. I need you to find my messenger, Yerimos. This was the messenger from the note. Yes, it's imperative Yerimos is freed and reaches the ship I've read it for him. Where's the ship I need to take him to? For now, it's safer you don't know. Once you find him, he will tell you. Tell me about this messenger of yours. He's of no significance, but his mission is. Find him so he can complete it. What mission is your messenger on? The fewer people who know, the better. But understand, it is vital to the future of Athens. Where should I look for Yerimos? 
If the Spartans have him, he'll be in the old quarry. I have it on good authority they're holding all their prisoners there. Don't worry. I'll get this Yerimos of yours to the ship. I've been looking for you. I saw your message. What's happened? Was a shipwreck or something near here? Divers were bringing me all kinds of gems to make inlays and decorations for my swords. Were bringing? Why aren't they still bringing them to you? All those divers attracted sharks, I guess. There's still a chest or two down there, but they won't go near it. And you want me to gut all the sharks? Are you up for it? I'll take care of it. You're a godsend. Leave it to me. I saw the note you posted. What's the matter? My play was a disaster, Mistyos. The actor was drunk, the malakas, he ruined it! What did he do? What didn't he do? Stumbling around, slurring the lines he didn't forget? He even spewed vomit on the front row! Oh, I was a fool to think an idiot goat herd could be an actor. But I'll have my revenge. You want me to kill him? Yes. His death will solve everything. All right, I'm in. You're a true hero. I'll be back when everything's taken care of. on high alert here. That's settled. It.
You again. Have you killed him? Your man is dead. The gods favored me the day we met. Take this for your trouble, Mistyos. I always finish what I've started. <laughs> 